Hello, it is um, the fifth of or the third of May, twenty twenty Sunday. The third of May, twenty twenty Sunday, and I'm Mark. Had a dream. And um, I was working in some kind of like a manufacturing place or clothing store or something like that. And um, I talked with a few people there. And then I had to like take off because I was sick or something, concerned about something. I was sick or concerned about something. I had to take off work. And the same day... I went in to talk with um, with somebody I worked with, and he said, "Don't tell." He said, um, "He said don't tell some don't tell people about me or don't tell people about this." And I didn't. And um, but they were promoting the two people I knew. They were promoting. My boss was promoting. So I, I wanted to ask the boss about my promotion, about being promoted or something. And um, uh, I said, Dan or whatever, can I speak with you? And he said, no. He said, no. And he just looked straight ahead and walked straight on. And then I asked the guy that told me not to tell anybody about him. About something about him, and I, and, I, and I said, can I speak with you? He said, nope. And um, later on, I said, look, I didn't tell anybody about you. I had another question like about being promoted or something. And, um, and there was a, a woman there, and she was promoted too, and they were all young. I was the only one that was older. And um, I was on the phone or something, and behind me were like different types of socks they were selling. And they were my dirty white socks. And they um, pulled, pulled, then the, 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 the manager pulled, took them up and hung them beside the clean um, socks for sale. They were like pink socks or blue socks or something, like girl socks for sale. And he hung them up with those other socks. And that was the end of the dream. Christian, oh, oh yes, which I think meant I was fired. I think it meant I was fired. It's warm enough to do videos outside. Um, yeah, um, but um, the boss would not listen to me. The boss would not listen to me. You know why? Why I wanted to ask him about a promotion. I think it was about a promotion. I had the dream about twenty minutes ago, thirty minutes ago. I had the dream, but he just, you know, would not look at me and just like had a, had a frown on his face or just like a cold look on his face. And um, when he hung up, hung up my dirty socks. For some reason, we weren't supposed to be wearing socks or something. I don't know. And so he got, got my dirty socks and he hung them up. And um, I was fired. Christians get put behind. Christians get kept behind. I I know I, I'm pretty sure it was a, it was a story. I know it was a story about my um, situation now. You know, I have a college degree and I can't work. I'm not allowed to work. They don't say that. They don't say, well, Mark, they don't say, well, Mark does, can't, 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 is not allowed to work. They say, why don't, why don't you get a job? Uh, I would rather be working Except for the prayer and the stuff, except for the prayer and Christian stuff, I want to do. I'd rather be working. Um, Christians don't get a fair break. I um, am drugged, so I can't work. 
I'm drugged by a psychiatric institution, so I can't work. And um, we're held back. I mean, I, I kind of like I like the views that I get on YouTube. I'll do some videos that people will think are interesting or good, and I'll get like two views on it, twenty views on it, fifty views on it maximum. That's about all I get on my views. Um, you know, it's the same thing. I like these people, you know, that do more boring stuff, in my opinion, a lot of times. They get hundreds of thousands of views within a single day. Hundreds of thousands of views. I've seen some, some Christian videos. I do Christian videos, so I, I see some Christian videos. And I'm just thinking, you know, why do people watch this crap? And they get hundreds of thousands of views or tens of thousands of views a day. So even this, even um, whatever the guy's name is now, um, Mario Breeson, um, the um, the vigilant one, I think is what he calls himself now, or vigilant something or another. Um, He'll get you know, tens of thousands of views a day. Maybe. One day, first day he puts it out, but ten thousand views, at least thousands of views. And you know, Christians just don't get their get their due. They help they hold us back. They um they hold us back. Um it's why I look old because of the drug I'm on. And um, the psychiatric drug I'm on, it's why I can't work. But I'm just not allowed to work. I mean, it, um, the government has their will. The government has their will. They don't like Christians. Other people don't like Christians. So, uh, you know, it, it ends up being hand to mouth. It ends up being hand to mouth, you know. I get some money. I say, great, I have money. And... You know, it goes to my food. It goes to my rent. It goes to my internet. You know, and it's just not much. It's just not much left over. I would prefer to be working. I've been thinking about working, but I don't think I'm allowed to. The government doesn't allow it. The government doesn't allow it. So we Christians end up being put behind in the last place. Um. I'm a Southerner. People talk about how bad Southerners dealt with blacks and how, or how bad they deal with blacks. But in the past, Christians were slaves. Okay.